Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Santerra. Hope everyone's well. I am still working toward getting the November readings done. <laughs> We're hoping to have November and December all read by the end of the day, Thanksgiving Day. So that would be Thursday, November 26th. So, because my birthday is the 29th of November, <laughs> and I will be 40. <laughs> Friday, Saturday, Sunday, other than the weekend top and, or the, the weekly top and bottom of the deck, I won't, probably won't be reading cards next weekend. So, anywho, who's next? Aries, you're up. Okay, it's reading for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, if it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with a message given by the cards if you choose to do anything at all. Just see that? Reflexes like a cat. It's your journey, not mine. I just read the cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay, too. You can check your moon, rising, or Venus sign readings. These are new cards, and they're not wanting to shuffle. Maybe you'll find something that resonates a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy will fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. So this could have played out at any point during the month of November. It still has about a week where it could play out. So... Might play out from the perspective of a cross watcher, and I encourage you that if it is absolutely not your story and it is not resonating at all, do not take what does not belong to you. Just leave the cards on the table and walk away. It's that simple. It's not your message, it's not your message. It's very general. Or I try to make them as general as possible. Sometimes the universe uses me to deliver special messages to people. I, I'm just a vessel. I'm reading cards here, guys. It's all I'm doing. Okay. One more shuffle. We're going to throw them down for Aries, November 2020. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, November 2020. Aries, why are you here? Knight of Pentacles. Hmm. Slow moving energy. You could have an offer you want to make someone, or you're waiting for someone to make an offer to you. Could be an earth sign you're dealing with. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? Six of Cups. Oh, wow. That's like old soulmate energy. That, that's beautiful, happy memories. You could have known this person from childhood. You could have just known him for a long time. Or you... It was like they gave you that vibe like you felt like you'd known them forever. Could be that, too. Because that's how the whole soulmate things work. Like, sometimes you meet someone and you feel like you've literally known them forever. It's because your souls have known each other forever. It may not have been in this life. That's how that works, if you're not aware. So, you know. What do you think of the person? Father Wands, you might see them as a little bit confrontational. Could be a fire sign you're dealing with. Water, the Six of Cups, fire with the Five of Wands. Maybe they just, you know, they're argumentative energy, possibly. Okay. What do you want from them, Aries? King of Cups reversed. That's loaded. I don't think you want them to shut their emotions off. Maybe damp them down a little bit. We'll throw a clarifier on in a second. How do they feel about you? Queen of Cups reversed. Mm -hmm. Somebody's lost feelings here. Or they feel like you didn't feel anything. Hmm. What do they think of you? Page of Pentacles. Apologies are in order. <laughs> Either given or received. Maybe they th think they have something they need to apologize for. Maybe they think you have something you need to apologize for. Apologies are in order. Hmm. What do they want from you? Five of Swords. Let me throw a clarifier on it. My first just off off the top of my head. Picking up pieces. Alright, we're going to lay these out. We'll flip them in a minute. We're going to get some clarity on the cards that are already visible. Universe, Source, and Spirit, can I get some clarity on the cards on the table for my Aries friends, please? Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, November 2020. I got new decks. 
Isn't that beautiful? They shuffle so nice when they're not fighting with me. The steampunk deck likes to fight with me. Which is terrible, not so much. At least not today. Okay. Oh, hi. The world reversed. Mm, Aries. Unfinished business. Hmm. Apologies are in order. Unfinished business. Wanting to make an offer or receive an offer. Hmm. Okay. That chapter not ready to close out yet, maybe? I don't know. I was reading cards. Why is six cups here? Five of Swords reversed. How do you feel about them? Six of Cups with the Five of Swords reversed. Happy memories, but things were just kind of left scattered. One more. Possibly for some of you, you feel like things went on behind your back. Maybe. I don't know. That's that's weird and loaded. I'm going to see if those flip. I'm not sure which one wanted to flip out. Hi. Four of Pentacles reversed. Aries, you may have already released this. Seven of Pentacles. Card of Divine Timing. Weird. You could feel like they're a patient person or they're just waiting for the right time. Hmm. What is Five of Wands here? Three Swords reversed. Oh, wow. Empress reversed. What do you think of them? They're confrontational. You don't think. It wasn't going to go anywhere. Or it wasn't going in the direction you wanted it to go in. Why is the Three of Swords reversed here? Page of Cups. Why is the M? All right, we're going to try that again. Why is the Empress reversed here? I saw a lover's card in a tower. So we'll see if they come back out. Confrontation, spats, arguments, band aids. I got a page of cups and a three of swords reverse. That's a band aid. That's band aids. The full card jumped in. This may have been a situation that was very jumped into. That maybe. You're thinking like didn't have the potential to go where you wanted it to go. But why is the Empress reversed here? One more in this Empress reversed, please. Six of so six of wands.
There could have been family issues. I'm hearing family issues. Someone had to jump on the steed and take care of their family. So you see the other person is confrontational. Wasn't going to go anywhere. Possibly someone was trying to mend a broken heart here. Okay, why is the King of Cups reversed here? For what Aries wants from the other person? Why is the ki Why is the King of Cups reversed here? You want to talk? King of Men, accept it. King of Cups upright. Oh, wow. Aries, that's so sweet. You want them to know that you felt something. Oh, what fell? What fell? Where'd it go? Where did it go? There it is. Knight of Swords reversed. Oh, wow. Why is the Knight of Swords reversed here? Ace of Wands. You want them to know that you did feel something, but it's, it's time to move on and start something new. It's time to accept it. Wow. Wow. All right, why is... Let me check this real quick. Why is the Queen of Cups reversed here? How the other person feels about Aries. Got a twofer! Four of Swords reverse, Two of Wands. Wow. I feel like you were cold and unfeeling and... Okay, that makes sense now. They feel like you were cold and unfeeling and... You just got restless and wanted to move on. That's how they feel. That you were at a crossroads in your life and you got restless and without any kind of feeling or emotion, you just booked. That's how they feel. Probably That's what, probably why they feel like there's apologies in order. Why is the Page of Pentacles here for what the other person thinks of Aries? Five of Wands, Five of Pentacles. confrontation. I feel like they got left out in the cold. I feel like when it all blew up, they got left out in the cold. One more on that. That's making sense now. This is all making sense now. High Priestess, but they still feel that connection to you. They, they still think it's there. They still think you're connected. Which you probably are. You got a Six of Cups up there. That's soulmate stuff. 
This is major soulmate stuff, guys. I mean, five wands, five wands. Five of swords reversed, five of swords upright. Why is the five of swords upright here for what the other person wants? King of swords, nine of wands. They want the truth. They want to pick the pieces up. They want the truth. They want truth spoken. They want truth received. They want one last, but they want one last shot. One more. Star reversed. Possibly they haven't healed from this, this yet and they need to or they want to and they maybe did Nine of Pentacles reversed. They want to feel needed Wow Okay, what was the obstacle here Aries? King of Swords The obstacle here was the truth. Logical decisions rather than emotional ones. Can I get a clarifier on that, please? Why is the King of Swords here? Queen of Pentacles. Oh, somebody found a catch and went after it. One more. Hmm. Aries, are you dealing with the Sagittarius? Because Ace of... I just read their cards and their Ace of Cups was right here. Somehow I don't see it an obstacle to ever lead with your head instead of your heart, but... Queen of Pentacles, Ace of Cups. Hmm. Seven of Cups. Somebody had options. Did somebody exercised their right to have options. Did somebody chose a cup. That's all there is to it. I mean, the Ace of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles can both represent self-respect, self-love. Somebody in this situation was not treated fairly. I think somebody in this situation was not treated the way they needed to be treated or should have been treated. Hmm. This is the vibe I'm getting off the rest of this. Especially down in here. Apologies are in order. Alright, what's a possible resolution for this? Wild and crazy night of readings. Okay, nine of cups. Do what makes you happy. Well, there's the tenth cup right there. Well, there's the other nine. Depends on what angle you're looking at. Can I get one on this nine of cups, please? Page of swords. Have the conversation.
Ace of Pentacles reversed. Hmm. One more. Do what's best for you, Aries. Do what makes you have have the conversation. Be honest in the conversation. Don't be confrontational. Don't be all squabbling and fighting. I think you've done enough of that by the looks of things. And if the seed's meant to grow, it's meant to grow. If it's not, it's not. It's up to you what you do with the seed. Outcome. Eight of Pentacles reversed. Uh, ultimately, I don't see either one of you putting any energy into this. This is so weird, Aries. If you're not going to work on it, why... Okay, you know what? Can I get one on the outcome, please? Four of Cups reversed. Not putting the work into it, ignoring the situation. Why would it tell you to have the conversation then not do anything about it? Okay. Eight of Pentacles reversed, Emperor reversed. It's either don't do anything about it altogether, don't pour your energy into it, just ignore it, or it's not time yet. Possibly with this Emperor Reverse doing anything about it in the here and now could just spiral or everything out of control. So, let's get some advice from the cards and then we're going to call it an evening. Seven of Cups and the Hanged Man, they both already came out. So, be careful which path you choose. And it may just serve you better to accept the fate of the situation. Ten of Pentacles reversed in the Nine of Wands. Mm. Eyes open. Didn't the Ten of Pentacles reversed pop out somewhere? Or was that Sagittarius? I don't know, I'm getting them confused now. And Nine of Pentacles reversed. may have been Sagittarius. I apologize. I get them confused. Fire is fire to me, but mind which path you choose. It may just serve you best to accept the fate of the situation. It may not be wise or abundant to give this one last push. Alright, that's where we're at. Weird scattered energies tonight, guys. I don't know. Hmm. It's been a weird time for everybody. I think we're all just going to be super glad when 2020 is over with. <laughs> I know I will be. Just saying. Mm -hmm. I'm ready to close a chapter and start a new one myself. So, okay, guys. This has been November. Your December readings will hopefully... I'm going to try like hell. We'll be up by the end of the day Thursday. So, be blessed. Thanks for coming by. I love you to bits. Let me know if it resonates. I'll catch you later.